This is going to be on Predator Quest this year. So I've uh, got the television contract. It's in my inbox. I'm planning on signing it. So I just want all of you to know uh, that PQ will be coming back out of the closet. We're going to be laying them down. We're going to be doing what we do best. Hello, everyone. Beautiful sunset tonight. Just made uh, one stand this evening and we got her done. Got her done. Low, low internet con connection. Uh, we're out trying to tear it up, me and my brother. I'm gonna hand the phone to my brother so he can film me and I'm gonna tell you what happened here. And I'm gonna switch it around here. Let me see. Here's my brother, guys. <laughs> I'll tell you what happened here. All of you guys know that uh, I've come back out of the closet now and starting to hit it again. And uh, I hadn't shot a coyote for two seasons and I shot I shot my first coyote about, about a month and a half ago. It was mid-January when I shot my first coyote for one whole year I didn't shoot one and then the next just about another year. So. I, I actually kind of come out of retirement. I needed a break. You know how that goes. You just get burnt out. It's a lot of work doing all this stuff. I wouldn't be coming back, but I felt led to do so, and it's because of all of you. Um, there's so many people that email me and message me on Facebook. Just, Les, we really miss your show. When are you guys going to be back on? I mean, I have literally people that are crying to me, wanting me back on television. So, you know, it's hard. It's a it's a constant grind. But I'm going to make it work this year. I'm going to. I've just committed myself. I'm going to do it. I've uh, started reaching out to sponsors. My brother's helping me, and uh, we met up tonight for one quick stand. I drove a hundred and some miles just down to my brother just so we could have one stand tonight made one stand and we shot three coyotes on one stand uh, I shot two with a shotgun and one with a rifle um, now's the time if you're gonna be killing coyotes you want to help the deer you want to help the cattle the calves now's the time that you can really score on coyotes and the reason being is because after they've done their breeding they get aggressive like this male and this female came in together and they came in side by side like as fast as they could run so shotgun both of them just boom but actually it took more than that shooting wise I <laughs> they scared the living crap out of me because they came hard left I wasn't paying attention I was looking right and I caught movement and this big male had his hackles up and he was literally about 10 feet from me come ripping right by me so the thing is I want to share what I'm doing with you and and my brother you know he doesn't have a Facebook account he he lives vicariously through my eyes because I tell him what all of you are saying and I feel terrible and I've told you guys this a hundred times I don't post much on Facebook. I'm not that kind of guy. I'm not ego driven. I don't need to let everybody know what I'm doing every minute of the day. I'm not like that, but I want to share my experiences. And this is my passion, and you guys know that. And, you know, just right here, the, the calves we saved, the fawn deer we saved, the pheasants we've saved, it's amazing. When these things live for one whole year, you it'd scare you if you knew how many other animals they eat in one season. So, shotgunning, Hornady, heavy magnum, coyote loads, nickel-plated BB, there is not a better load out there. I, I, I kill more coyotes than anybody on film, guaranteed, and that is what does it. It's, it's the killer for coyotes, and thank you to Hornady for letting me help and wanting my feedback I know everybody's having trouble finding it because they're sold out everywhere and that's just a true testament of what they can do we're gonna try to get out of here I wanted to share this with you guys I'm happy it was fun I'm getting back in the groove 
possibly going to be going hard this week and trying to get it done. But uh, this is the big lanky male I shotgun. Just a big old coyote, you know. He's a big mature coyote, and he come ripping in, no fear in the world, and I, I shotgun him. You know, how old is he? I don't know. I, he's he's an adult. He's probably two to five years old just looking at his teeth. So that's the thing right now. We're trying to outsmart these coyotes. I appreciate all of you for watching. This is going to be on Predator Quest this year. So I've uh, got the television contract. It's in my inbox. I'm planning on signing it. So I just want all of you to know uh, that PQ will be coming back out of the closet. We're going to be laying them down. We're going to be doing what we do best. So thank you, everybody. Uh, love each and every one of you, and I appreciate all of you. So thank you for joining me right now. Jeff says thank you, too. <laughs> He's quiet, but uh, thank you, everybody. Take care. Have a great night. Love you guys. We'll see you.